second video I started in the bathroom, but good things start here. Anyways, um, I'm about to take a quick shower. I just got off of work right now. And honestly, I got off work a little late because my supervisor keeps freaking emailing me and he's like, hey, check this, try this, try this. And it's like, dude, I'm off of work right now. But like, it's okay. It's really okay. Cause he's being like super nice. And honestly, like it's fine. Anyways, so I'm about to take a shower because I have an audition today. We have an audition today. We have an audition today. We have an audition at a club in Queens. And actually it seems like, um, it actually seems like a good club. It seems like money be thrown in that club. So like trying to be up in that club. Also, there's a pretty poppin' DJ who works at that club who's like pretty known. He works for a um, big radio station in New York. If you know, you know. So I'm about to take a shower and I think I actually might put on makeup today, but I'm rushing because it's over at six. It's like 3.50 right now. I'm trying to be out the door by five o'clock. It's only 15 minutes away, so I can get there by 5.15, you know what I'm saying? So, and then I have some place to be at seven. So let me hurry up and take a shower because I'm gonna spend the most time on my hair and makeup. Oh, let me just say real quick, first of all, are y'all proud of me for posting, um, like, five times this past, like, two weeks, like, <laughs> no, but seriously, like, and there's my supervisor hanging at the end, it's gonna take me, like, five more minutes to get in the shower because I just need to click and see what he's saying. What's up? So I just got off the shower. It's exactly 4.15 and I got in the shower at like 4.01 or something. I don't know. So shout out to me. I almost didn't want to get out because the water was feeling too good, but I smell good. I feel okay. Um, I have no idea where my makeup is because I physically have not worn my makeup. I don't know how many months. It's been a long, it's been a little minute. So I'm going to look for my makeup and then I'm probably going to do my hair first so that I can keep the scarf on while I do my makeup. So I'm going to see you guys after I get ready. Okay, so complete um, change of plans from what I thought I was going to do. I was going to put on makeup today. I was going to um, straighten my hair, but I could not find my makeup bag anywhere, literally anywhere wasn't in my suitcase wasn't in my duffel bag wasn't it wasn't anywhere that's the point it, i could not find my fucking couldn't find my makeup bag anyways it might be in my car maybe that's why i can't find it but i don't know so because i spent like 20 minutes looking for my makeup bag out of the time i was supposed to be taking to get ready um i was going to just put on some eyeshadow and lashes but i thought about it i'm like no i'm gonna look weird because gonna be able to tell the bottom of my face is not done if I have glitter and glam ass lashes and then bags under my eyes you know what I'm saying like the vibes are not it's not giving bad bitch it's getting tired and getting lazy to have half a face done so I figured I'm gonna just do lashes and put on some lip gloss or um I think I have a brown liquid lipstick in my bag I might I do that's gonna be literally perfect my brown lip is my favorite oh so I'm manifesting that I already got hired so when I go to work this weekend um, I'm trying to think if I should reinstall this or just get my hair braided because I want these long chunky box braids sounds to my booty Okay, so I am walking to my car right now. It said it was raining, so I put my fucking bonnet on. It's not raining. I wasn't even expecting rain today. But you know, the iPhones just updated and now they're like real precise with their predictions. So my iPhone says that it's gonna start raining in six minutes, probably five minutes now, because I've been outside for a minute. I parked two blocks away, three blocks away. 
so I was just in the office with the manager and I was talking to him and stuff. Everything seems cool. I feel like I already got the job, but I have to audition. But he asked me if I can stay, so I think I already got the job. But I'm changing now. Wish me luck. I'm mad nervous. I haven't been in the club in a minute. And I have another audition this week too, so just wish me luck. Chick-fil-A closes at 10, so I need to leave right now because I'm 10 minutes from Chick-fil-A and I haven't eaten dinner, so I'm getting Chick-fil-A for dinner, so. Let's go. We can do a money count when we get back to the crib. We can do an audition right now. I'm on my way home. Um, it was a cute little audition. If you work during day shift, you get free drinks. So I got two free drinks. Um... I made a little bit of money during my audition, like on stage. And this customer, he literally gave me a probably like, I only from one customer all night. He probably gave me like ten dollars in singles, 
and then he tipped me a little more on stage so literally probably made thirty dollars which i think is pretty good for an audition especially on a monday night i'm not mad at it i literally expected zero dollars from an audition so the fact that i got anything is like great because i'm gonna put that in my gas tank real shit okay so i just got home and i've been home for like 10 15 minutes i just made some noodles right here i'm about to eat those noodles but i want to do a quick money count for you guys of my audition tips um hope i didn't leave my id card in here oh it's right here i did not my id but um so this is the money from my audition i literally think it's like 30 dollars but let's see and we're gonna find out Sorry, I don't really have a good position to put you guys in. Um, I guess that's fine. So yeah, all of my tips were from one customer. Um, all the girls were nice. Um, most of the girls were nice. One of the girls I met her, she was. Um, I was like, "How long you been here?" She's like, "A long time, bitch." But then I was start having conversation with this other girl. She want to start trying to jump in, like. And then there was this other girl, when I first got there, um, I was talking to this customer. I was supposed to go audition on stage, but I was talking to a customer. So as I'm talking to the customer, obviously he's not going to pull me away from the customer and be like, hey, go on stage. So, um, yeah, I was talking to this other girl and she was like, oh, um, I want to see you on stage. I'm like, no, I'm just trying to sit here and chill. She going to go to the manager and be like, oh, uh -uh, like put her on stage she didn't go on stage i'm like sis whatever i get on stage as soon as i get on stage bitches is like oh oh shit oh okay all right oh you you nice and i swear to god i'm not trying to brag but like i'm trying to become a pole instructor so obviously it would make sense that i would be okay on the pole right they see me on the pole i'm like yeah bitch you made me get up here now you get up on the pole and then you get up on the stage and she didn't know how to do any pole tricks and i was like not like it bad or anything but like i was trying to teach her some shit but it's just like bitch you tried to call me out and make me get on the stage i don't know if you thought i was gonna be bad or something but the whole time i just fucked it up and you can't do the shit i just did but um not to be rude or anything she was really nice honestly i like her i like all the girls there that i met tonight so this is this is our audition stack and let's see how much we made for this audition okay so we made a total of $48, which is lit because it's more than I thought. So $48 from audition. We're just going to say $50. $50 audition. It's lit. Um, and literally, there was no customers in there. I made this all from one customer. And I made him tip the other girls. I always do that. Like, I'm like, oh, you're not going to tip her? I'm going to look at her. Because girls will do the same thing for me. They'd be like, yo, tipper, like, I don't know. It's like, we working together. Let me secure the fucking bag together. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, this was a really good day. Um, Tomorrow night, the celebrity DJ is supposed to be there. So I'm debating on if I'm going to go tomorrow or not. I don't know yet. But Friday is a definite because I know there's money up in that club. And I have another audition on Thursday. So maybe I'll just bounce around between two clubs. I'm not sure yet, but we'll see. But anyways, thank you for watching this vlog. Please like, comment, subscribe, and all that good stuff. And I will see you in the next video. And we'll be back with another scripper vlog. So I'll see you soon. Bye.